Hey everyone, welcome to AG Tech. So in this video, I wanted to share something with you guys, particularly you guys who are still on Windows 11 21H2. So Windows 11 21H2, if you guys remember, was the very first version of Windows 11. In my opinion, it was not the best. And I believe most people didn't like it too. I even reverted back to Windows 10 for a while because of how bad it was. But anyways, Microsoft has announced an end of life and support for version 21H2 very, very soon. And according to Microsoft, they will no longer be supporting 21H2 Home and Pro editions starting on October 10th, 2023. And for the other editions such as Enterprise and Education, it will be October 2024, so a little bit later. However, 21H2 is still going to get the October security update, and that will be the last update on that version. After that, there will not be any more quality or security updates for this version of Windows 11. I want to clarify that people will still be able to use 21H2, the version won't go into a black hole and disappear forever. It just won't be supported by Microsoft anymore. Therefore, it won't get any more quality and security updates. Those are those updates are like really important for the health of your PC. And that's why if you guys want these quality and security updates, you guys will have to upgrade to Windows 11 22H2 as 23H2 is still in the works. It's not it has not been released yet. This is basically what's going to happen to Windows 10 in 2025. So if you guys want more info on um, the end of life of 21H2, you guys can go ahead and check the article on the Microsoft website and I'll leave the link in the description for you guys below. But real quick, I want to show you guys what you can do if you guys want to switch or upgrade to 22H2 real quick. All you guys want to do is go to your start menu and go over to your settings. And once you're on your settings, you want to go all the way down to Windows Update. And now what you're going to do, if you're on 21H2, you're just going to click check for updates and you will automatically get an update saying an upgrade to 22H2. And all you have to do then is download and install it and give your PC a restart and then you'll be on 22H2 and you'll be able to get quality and security updates pretty much every month. Another way you can upgrade to 22H2 is to download the ISO from the Microsoft website. So all you want to do is open your browser. You're going to just type in download Windows 11. And if you scroll down the first option, download Windows 11 Microsoft.com. If you go ahead and click that and scroll down, you're going to see download Windows 11 disk image. Just click a select download Windows 11 and go ahead and click download now just look just look for english as the as the product language if you're in the united states or the uk but if you're somewhere else you can just choose your language you're going to click confirm there your download is ready under download windows 11 english and all you have to do is just click 64-bit download and what that's going to do is it's going to download the iso for you and then once the file opens you want to go ahead and click setup and now here you've got the Windows 11 installation. This is going to give you the latest Windows 11 build or version, which is 22H2. So all you want to do is click next and start the setup and go through the setup. And it's going to install Windows 11 for you. Windows 11 22H2, which is the main version for you. And you will be on the latest version of Windows 11. For those of you on Windows 11, 21H2. I highly recommend you guys to upgrade to 22H2 because of the quality and security updates and those ensure the health of your PC. When you're when you don't get those updates from Microsoft, your PC can become vulnerable and that would not be good. Consider leaving a like and uh subscribing to my channel if you like the content. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you guys in the next one.